Um, what is your verdict, Darren Ambrose? I know you're a Spurs fan, mm. but give us a, a, an unbiased, if you can, view of, of that performance from an Arsenal perspective. Yeah, I mean, it was a difficult one for me today, obviously being a, a associated highly with Palace as well. To, to kind of be supporting Brighton today was, was quite difficult. But I, I, it was a great performance from Brighton. Now, if well, they're coming off of the not winning in seven, I believe. And barely scoring any goals. Barely scoring. I think the last three they hadn't scored at all. Couple of great goals mm. from from Brighton. There's an offside decision that I I personally thought it was clearly offside. Yeah. Now I could be wrong. Of course, we know that. I know it was given offside, but I just felt the last two games for Arsenal they've they've taken a real knock, particularly against Crystal Palace. I sat here with Andy Goldstein and said Crystal Palace will win that game, mm. and it wasn't because of my association with Palace. I just felt they that Arsenal are not strong enough in in terms of they they can't seem they can't go for the whole season in my opinion with the squad they have they've got some great players Saka Martinelli uh, Odegaard Emil Smith-Rowe Lacazette's come into the team but they're still young you said that earlier they're, mm. they're a young squad a few weeks ago I, I, th- I said potentially they are top um, forward, uh, forward for the the top four. I, I think, think they e- were the favourites. Everybody had them nailed on. They for had, a top I four think score. they were three points above Spurs. A mm-hmm. couple of games in hand on Spurs. Three games in hand on Manchester United. They've just taken a real hit at the worst possible time mm. for, for for those. I must say, Sanchez for for Brighton was outstanding. Oh, yeah. Some of the saves right at the end right as well because the they were throwing everything yep. at Brighton yep. towards the end. There was a, a ridiculous amount of, of added time. Six yep. minutes, I think it it was too in the much. end. <laughs> so that was all the offside <laughs> too much, decision. Too much but for you. I, but I had a conversation with the Arsenal supporter in the office, and, mm. and they said that the it, single it, it guessed <laughs> uh, it guessed the offside, and I don't think they did. Well. They Why was guess, it so they long? I said, well, it. The fact it was so long, in my opinion, meant they didn't guess. They spent as long as they needed to get that right. And Still too long, I agree with it, that. It was way too long. And I, I felt it, was, it wasn't it was an obvious offside. It was close, but you have to have the goalie and a player. Mm-hmm. Cucurella, there was one angle you could kind of see his legs weren't anywhere near um, Sanchez in, in the goal. So it was offside. They took too long. It, it's unfortunate. They're still in the race, of course. They just need to a little bit more consistency. They now go, I, I believe, to Southampton, who are going to be looking at um, bouncing back from a, a terrible result. Um, and then they play Chelsea. So it's going to be tough for Arsenal. I was not, not, de- delighted. Not just, not just Chelsea. From a top four perspective, the next, uh, take the Southampton game at, um, yep. out of the equation. Their next three games after that are against Chelsea, Manchester United and West Ham. And then they've got the North London derby after Leeds. So this could is be over by then. season defining. Could be over by then. It could. The way Conte's got Spurs playing, it could be over by the North London derby. And I know the Premier League, that, that that's me being not optimistic, yeah. I'd say, that it'll be over that early. But Conte's got them playing it particularly well. And they, they Premier League put the North London derby on the 12th of May for that reason, because it could be the defining moment. It still could. I just... I. I can see Spurs going on a, another really good run, winning the next two or three games, and then going to the Liverpool game, Arsenal game. So they're very difficult, but you do Arsenal realise if that doesn't wins. if that doesn't happen, that's clipped oh, up clipped and up. used against you. Absolutely, I've no doubt <laughs> about it until the end of the season. <laughs>